What's up guys? Welcome to the course Introduction to Mass Transfer Operations. I'm really happy that you decided to enroll and hopefully you get the most value of this course. So before we even continue, I want to give you the overview of why I created this course, what's this course all about and why do we need it so bad, especially if you're talking about mass transfer operations alone. So the main idea of the course is for you to understand what are the several type of processes or unit operations involved in mass transfer. For instance, we have or we know that there are distillations, we know that there are uh, maybe some filtering processes, we know that there might be membranes, we know there are adsorption columns, but what is actually behind that? We're going to be covering that section by section, we're going to be talking about phase creation versus phase addition processes. We're going to understand what is the concept of barrier, such as membranes, why do we need them? Uh, we're going to see also solid agent separations, uh, adsorption for instance, chromatography. We're going to be also talking about physical and mechanical separations, which are very important. And the objective of this course is that when you finish this course, you understand all the several processes that are involving mass transfer, but more importantly, understand what are the advantages, disadvantages, when can we use a certain type of process, why do we use this other separation technology instead of this other one, and of course understand what's a distillation, what's a gas absorber, what's a scrubber, what's a filter, what's a membrane system, what's reverse osmosis, what's uh, I don't know, there are many operations and the idea is at the end of this course you will understand them and not only that, maybe even be suitable to know whether or not a process or separation process is feasible. Okay guys, I don't want to confuse you with all the units that we're going to be studying in this course, but definitely I'm very happy that you decided to enroll and hopefully you get the most value of this course. I'll see you in the following lectures.